about today was Mary Ryder put a photograph of, of a beach in Hawaii pointing out how much litter there was on it and I put a photograph up of uh, some of the litter on this little beach here in Little Island uh, just as a comparison because really I didn't see any difference uh, whereas Hawaii is quite far away Little Island is not that far away and we can come down and clear up the litter and that's what got me going so it's all her fault so I don't take any credit for this whatsoever Mary, Mary Ryder don't forget her name now <laughs> Well, to be honest, I was shocked. I, I couldn't get over it. The place looked terrible. There's lots of litter all over the place, strewn. And I mean, the other thing is, is that uh, if you were to pan over, there's actually this quite a picturesque place. And people have put all the, uh, the uh, bottles and uh, milk bottles and plastic. And now we're up today to find little straws and all sorts of bits and pieces here, you know. Uh, we find relatively few bottles, but an awful lot of little bits of plastic rubbish that really shouldn't be here and be taken away from the look of the place, you know. Well, uh, talking to the locals, so they helped us a little bit too. Uh, apparently quite a bit of it comes in from the sea, but there's no doubt about it that also we were told that there's some um, fly tipping going on. So we picked up about three or four black bags of rubbish that people actually have thrown here deliberately. So some of it's coming from the sea, some of it's coming from uh, people wandering the beach, but uh, the vast majority seem to be coming in from the sea, which is quite uh, cause of great concern because, I mean, that's something that we can't really control. But on the other hand, it's a sign of how much rubbish there is in the sea. And today, hopefully, we cleared some of it away. You know? um, Ted, Ted Barkley uh, contacted me and said he was organising a, a clean-up. And um, would it be interesting coming down? So from there, it went on Facebook and the rest is history down here cleaning up so we've done a fair few cleanups um, over the year getting help from local industrials as well uh, getting help from the Cork County Council coming out picking up the rubbish as well 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 down here as far as from in quotes on you can see uh, most of the rubbish will be washed up and see as far as people then that would be I suppose forgetting you know not to take the rubbish home um, have a bin at home, put the rubbish in. Um, those look those various re reasons where rubbish come from. Um, it's very hard to pinpoint down the wood, but it's just to keep it, uh, just make people aware that there is a problem with rubbish around. And if it's clean, it's uh, safe for everyone to enjoy their uh, clean area. Well, to be honest, I got involved through this with my dad because um, he thought the project was worthwhile to look at because he'd come down here um, and saw how much rubbish there was and decided to um, organise a clean up. Um, honestly, I've been taking photos all day and the amount of rubbish was quite shocking because there's like a lot of little stuff, but there's also just unusual big stuff. We found a pillow at one stage and like um, there was a few bottles um, as well and stuff. I think people aren't really realising the effect it's having. They're just a bit careless and they don't really think of the consequences. What we found was drink bottles, drink bottles, and more drink bottles. About 80% drink bottles, I'd say. Other bits and pieces and things, but water bottles, sports drink bottles. We need to do something about them. Washed up by the tide, we think. Uh, maybe dumped, some of it. Hard to tell. Hard to tell, really. But it seems like a lot of it was brought in on the tide, yeah. Um, I saw... I saw an even worse beach than this across, straight across the, the, the water from it last year on Fota Island, a beach that's just, that's just barely visible from here was horrendously, horrendously covered ankle deep in rubbish. Worse than this beach, I don't know why, maybe the tides bring it. That was definitely brought in by the tide because nobody goes down to that beach. Much worse, much, much worse. It says that we don't think, we don't think about where our rubbish goes, we don't think about something, you know, have a drink, throw the bottle away, don't drink, don't care, I don't know, I think that's what it says, for a, about a lot of, a lot of people, an awful lot of people do care, but there's too many that don't.
Well, we've been very uh, 